Hey there, guys. Um, this is the begin the intro. My name is Kat, full time reseller on the Poshmark app. I took you guys with me today to the thrift, and we'll try to go to a few yard sales, but you're gonna see that that didn't work out for me. Uh, and then me and my best friend went to a thrift store about 30 minutes away. Really hooked up on some really good stuff. And um, if you've never been here, thank you so much for coming. So appreciate it. Um, and if you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. Um, I'm going to let the video roll out. And at the end, you will see our thrift haul. If you want to scroll past, if you do not, if that's what you came, came for. And if not, and, and there's just a few clips of me going into a couple of bomb yard sales and then thrift store. And then back home with the haul. So thank you so much for coming to watch and we'll see you in. Hello there and welcome back. If you are coming to watch me do all this and then eventually finish the video it is a rainy rainy friday but it is end of april it's the weekend before it's the friday before easter good friday i guess and um i'm heading to the atm so that i can get some cash because i'm going to some yard sales and you know it's april so april showers brings may flowers so they say um and um, I was going to drive to a city across, I'm in Kentucky, I was going to drive to Evansville, Indiana, which is about 35 miles away. But with the rain acting like it is, like, I don't want to drive all the way over there not to have success with the yard sales. So there's a few by me that say rain or shine. And um, there's even more tomorrow. So hopefully, on up to my buddy. Oh, hello, A2. <laughs> um, hopefully, I can get a few good, awesome things in, and hopefully, the people are not in coming out in growth because it is not the most great weather. So, um, I think it'll be a fun little come along thrifting with me, and at the end, I can kind of wrap it up and show you what I get. So, I'm thinking this; these people are going to think I'm a real nut job or I'm really dedicated to the cause because I'm at the yard sale, it's raining. But it did say rain or shine, so we shall see. Vacation when you'll walk through puddles. <laughs> hey, look, I'm not the only one. Let's see. Come on, Robin. That's real. Oh. Three minutes before all so their stupid high prices and not even say hello to me when I got there. No, and I walked through puddles to get to your sale. <laughs> so I have a few more nearby local that are um, supposed to be open right now. So I'm gonna try those instead. This bad boy. Mm -mm. All right, so um, I went to a couple yard sales, nothing happening. So Sam drove me out to hey. <laughs> to this place, which is the um, spot of all spots. It's really fun. It's a good, always a great deal in there. So let's go see what they're about. And it's a nasty day. I guess that's why the yard sales were no bueno. Oh, my favorite spot. Did you get your basket, Sam? I would start on the. Let's start. Right here. Let me go. Let's 
so we got um we got like six bags of clothes and like two bags of shoes for like thirty three dollars. We got Trina Turk, some Escapada. Do you get any big brands today, Sam? Oh, I don't, <laughs> don't put me on the spot. <laughs> she got some good brands too, but she can't think of them right now. All right, well, now I'm gonna go get it sorted and show y'all it. Show it to you guys. Alrighty, well, we just got back and um, we're just looking at all of our bags. Sorry about the hair. The rain is out there doing big things. Um, but um, I was looking at our bags and what I think I'm going to do to something to switch it up. Um, Sam and I shop separate, so I'm going to do... Um, Sorry. One of my bags, a shoe bag, and one of her bags. So I'll have no clue what uh, what is in the one of hers. So I thought that would be fun. And um, if I would have, were to go through like all nine of them today, then I would be sitting here forever and ain't nobody had time for that. So I'm going to go ahead and jump right to it. Um, first, I just want to say we spent... She spent 20 I spent 13 but she bought all the shoes. So they're a dollar a pair. Clothes at this particular little spot are $3. You fill a bag. And um, I think you can't really beat it. So, and it's a really, really nice area of town. It's in the country of like the nicest area in our town. And um, again, I got to dig, but there's definitely stuff to dig for. Alrighty, well, Sam's a little nervous because I'm going to randomly pick her stuff, but I think it'll be fun, and um, yeah, so I'm going to just hop to it because it's Easter weekend and hop, 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 dork. Alright, first up is Sam's bag. Looks like I have not Sam. Whoa, 5XL. Oh, you got a big lady up there. Okay, online new. That makes up with tags. <laughs> okay. No, it's not. That's kind of cute, actually. It's a jumpsuit. Whoa, what's a big... I mean... <laughs> no, it's probably one of those Wish brands that, like, runs really small. Oh, that's a horrible thing. <laughs> it's, um... That is a thing. <laughs> it's O... Onelive. Onelive. It's a 5X, so even if it is one of those, it's cute, I think. Yeah. Just say it was horrible. No, it's not horrible. Here's another. <laughs> She's gonna kill me. No, I'm not. But you didn't. The red tag. Another 5XL from the same brand. It looks like the same thing in a different color. No, I think they'll be good. I really do. I, I think they were cute. Though. They are I cute. I think they, they run like like small though. Yeah, they have to. There's no. I didn't think they were no 5X. That's um. We'll be looking into that 5X. Oh, I can't even tell what those letters are. O N E L V E. Um, oh so it's another, it's like a chambray romper. It's cute. Mm -hmm. Made of um, mm -hmm. polyester. It says 5X, but I'm thinking that 5X would have to be a little bit, it's more like a 2X, maybe 3X, I would say. Like in towards sizing. <laughs> this one is Elliot. It's a mini shirt. This is the same thing. It's nice. 
Made in Korea. And another men's shirt. Levi's color. Oh, this looks vintage. Sam didn't understand the red tag. Um, <laughs> Sam. Uh, the red tags stay on. But she didn't know. It's her first time. And it was still only $20 for all her stuff, so. I think some of the ladies, they just charge you for any clothing. Levi's color graphs. I've never even heard of that, but looks good. And Express Design Studio. Made in Hong Kong, so we know that's vintage. Let's see that on there. So it's like an express men shirt, vintage. Nice. All right. I'm gonna go to another bag. This one is my bag, and I, I can already know it's on top here. Um, anything they have in there with the red tag is three dollars for the whole bag. That's how that works. So. Um, this is a uh, first time ever with a Trina Turk. It's kind of like a cape blazer. Um, I found similar comps. They're pretty decent. Yeah, I did not find this exact one yet. So, hoping it's decent. It's been on my bucket list for a while to get a twin of her. Alrighty. Make sure I pick this one up because it's new with tags, yeah. This is um nothing uh super special but it's the limited but it's got a ninety dollar new with tag price tag so it's just um I believe just a little shift dress it could be like a tunic that I picked that up pretty much and it's an eight so it's not super small um, This one is Speed Control New York. Um, never heard of this particular brand. But I think it was cute. It's got a little zip front. So large. That's what the label looks like. Um, this is a mini dress. Another that could also be worn as a tunic if you want. Um, this I got pretty much for the style only. It's uh, incorporated, or INC, incorpor in an, oh, okay. international concept, INC, I knew that. It's just a little cute, little bell sleeve. It's got a beta detail, the bodice. Looks cute. Um, I got the tucked in bottom, medium. And this one, it's one clothing. And it is actually like a um, sweater almost material. But it's got like a bedazzled studded unicorn on it. It is polyester and linen. Okay. It had like a linen feel to it. Super cute. Unicorns are super in. Um, I 
believe I have this one for the tag as well. Moa Moa. I haven't really got to look at anything yet. You guys are kind of seeing it with me. But it's cute. I thought this one was super fun. Being, and especially graphic, these are super in. This is a uh, Notorious B.I.G. I can't really tell if the brand says. But it's cute. Look for my son. This I picked up because I've actually sold. It's um, a bathing suit made by Spanx. It's the top only, fortunately, but next out it's a great size. Just show me your assets made by Spanx. It's a tankini. Oh yeah, this one looks good. This is um, Matilda Jane. Doesn't even ever look worn. This is for my child. This I thought was super cute. This is one of the last things I grabbed. It's a Scapata living. And it's just a super fun, like, what you would call that. Maybe like a poncho type. I don't know, really, but. And that's a good brand. Alrighty. I think that's it with that bag of clothes. And we're gonna go through just some shoes real quick. These are unstructured by Clarks. Um they're nine and a half linens. These, I believe, maybe you can change Maggie's, I don't know, it says patent pending. You can tell they've never been worn. This is a Earth Origins by Earth. There's some really nice leather women's eight and a half Rochester the style. These are just a really nice leather sandal. They're A Gianetti. And they look really, really classy. And they are style size. Thank you. This is another a meal the so YUU. I actually got that brand at the same thrift store before. I'd never seen it before. But they look like they've been worn a little bit, but they look really good still. These are Riker Anti-Stress. They're size 40, they're real cute.
This is the last thing I grab. It's like a MDT. MDT. But it looks kind of like a, one of those comfort orthotics that you can slip on. Okay, Swiss engineered. You can see that. I'm going to have to look into those a little further, but the match to the right there. Alrighty, and um, I think do the rest of the shoes since we're already here. Here's another pair of the structured Clarks. Nine and a half. These I wasn't sure about, but I thought they were cute. They're Tahari, black and gold wedge. And these are a little vintage booty. Sporto. Well, that is going to wrap it up for today. Thank you so much for coming along with us. And um, if you want to give me a thumbs up, that'd be awesome. And thank you for coming back to my channel if you've been here before. And if you haven't and it's your first time, I really appreciate you coming to watch. Um, I love doing the Poshmark related content. It's really, really fun for me. Pretty new at it, as you can tell by the get on of it. But... Um, Hopefully you saw something you liked and just an everyday, you know, so thank you.